Hello, hello, hello everyone, and welcome to another episode of Ship Views with me, Carburetor. Today, we are going to be looking at the Warhammer 40,000 container, or premium ships and containers. Now, here's the thing. If you were going to just buy this shit, I would say just go ahead and get this, uh, this pack that has everything in it. Or if you just want one ship, go ahead and purchase the one ship. But realistically, the only ship I don't want in here is the Dross of Dorne. And that's and that's not just, oh, well, I hate that ship. No, it's because I already have two of those ships. For those of you who don't know, it's basically a Mines. The Mines is a beautiful ship. It's a brilliant ship. I love the ship. But I don't need three of them. <laughs> I only need two. I have a long-range version and a short-range version, a random battle version, and a brawl version, basically. But what I would like is the ship Shmasha. It, and I'm going to call it that way because I <laughs> it, it is... It is, uh, I, I guess it'd be technically Chinese, but I guess it's actually Japanese. I don't know. And then I really want the, one, either the Ignis per Pergato or the Ragnarok. Now, both of those ships are basically the same ships. They're carbon copy versions of the Amagi, but I'd really like to have a premium tier eight battleship version of the Amagi. That way I can have it in, in, in my port. Before I had had the key in that role, but I kind of transitioned the role, the key into a secondary battleship role, so now I need something to fill that slot. Anyway, let's head up, let's purchase these containers. Now, for those of you guys who don't know, also, I've touched on this, but if you're going to buy these, buy the doubloons first, then purchase the containers with the doubloons. Because the way that they that it works, if you go into the premium shop, it's ninety nine dollars. You want to know what else is ninety nine dollars? Twenty five hundred doubloons. Or you come in here and they're twenty four, they're twenty four fifty doubloons. So you'll save fifty doubloons. And you may think, well, what what's that point? The way I look at it, your nickels and dimes. Watch your nickels and your dimes, and your dollars take care of themselves. That that is literally that that was something that was drilled into me by my grandpa, and. I take that to this day. But anyway, let's come over here and let's open it. First, I want to see just what my... I know that I should get, should get two ships. Because I believe it's a 9% drop chance. Yep, 9% drop chance. So I should get two ships. So I have a pretty good chance of getting the ship I want. A ship I want. But otherwise, we can get these camouflages. Bleh, sell them. Elite Commander XP or Blue cam or blue uh, Econ bonuses. Uh... Other than that, I mean, if I have all the ships, which I doubt I will, I'll get 100,000 Elite Commander XP. So, let's head over here and let's open these. Well, there was credits. <laughs> That's basically all I look at them as, they're credits. Blue Econ bonuses, looks like that's Commander XP. Ship XP. And I do get 14. That's a nice little... More camouflages that I'm just going to sell. And the, the pity mechanic is really bad on these, so... I should, I should get one ship at least. It's not looking too good, though. Ten, ten containers in, and I haven't gotten a ship yet. Come on. Come on. <sighs> Come on. Give me a, give me a ship. Come on. Oh, really? I was hoping to get two ships out of this. I'm going to be lucky if I get one.
Wow, what is this RNG? What in the heck? Come on, give me something I want. Give me the give me the ship. <sighs> Finally got elite commander XP. Really? Really? Oh, screw you, Wargaming. Screw you. What RNG engine are you guys using? What was the pity mechanic on these? I forget what the pity mechanic was. 25 containers, 9% chance of getting a ship. Yeah, bullshit. Bullshit. 27th container I'm guaranteed to get. So I'm going to buy five more containers. Let me do, 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 do. Even though I really shouldn't. Yeah, I would say, guys, that if you guys are looking to do this, just buy the ship you want. Because <laughs> this, is, this is ridiculous. This is broken. Finally! We triggered the pity mechanic. <laughs> okay, this was the third ship I wanted. Like, this was the third most ship I wanted. Like, what in the hell? Oh, Wargaming, you proceed to screw me. Thirty containers, one ship. Yeah, guys, don't uh, don't waste your money on these containers. Like I did it for fun. Like okay, you know that was kind of fun. That was I I I can show you guys what not to do. But like seriously, like war gaming. Your RNG engine is broken, and I don't mean broken in the sense that oh well, it just it sucks. No, it it is actually like that is that is. When when somebody says a game is cheating, that's what they mean. And like that game was cheating. That that was rigged from the get go. There was no way that that was nine percent drop rate. That was absolutely horrible. Like what in the heck, war gaming? Just go ahead and sell all these camos. Get some get some credits out of it at least. I really wish they would just it, like just keep the camos out. Just give me credits. Like seriously, just give me credits. I don't need camos. Like, holy cow. Well... That concludes it. The I did end up getting the ship Schmasa, which is, I believe it's a basically a carbon copy of the Fen Yang. Now I do have the Fen Yang, but it's still just one of those things where it's just, oh well, let's let's see if I can't get it and have some fun, you know, like I still really like it, so what happened here. So Yep, looks like it's just a Fen Yang copy. Let's see what... So, yep, basically just a Fen Yang copy. If you look there to there... Yep, Fen Yang. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed. Take care. Stay safe. If you're going to buy something, just buy the ship. Like, that was fun. But anyway, take care, and I'll see you all next time. Bye.